Well, what's up fam this is your girl amanda and i'm coming back to y'all with amanda vlog so let's talk kanye west so yesterday kanye was spotted arriving at the trump towers in new york where he met with president-elect donald dump trump yes y'all he met with donald dump trump yesterday and we all know that he has recently been released from the hospital because of his mental breakdown and issues that he has been facing. And so he met with Donald Donald Trump yesterday, y'all. Can y'all believe it? Mm, I can. Okay. So y'all check out this video of Donald and Kanye, honey. Just friends. Just friends. And uh, he's a good man. You've been doing well. Long time. We've been friends for a long time. Life. We discussed it. I just want to take a picture right now. Okay, so y'all saw the video, and did you see where the reporter asked Donald what him and Kanye discussed in their meeting? And did y'all see how Donald skirted past that damn question? Donald didn't even answer the question. He said, we are good friends, he's a good man, and we've been friends for a very long time. Since when have they been friends? I mean, unless they've been friends on the low, I'm just trying to figure out since when have they been friends for a very long time. We all know that Kanye went on a very long ass rant at one of his concerts talking about uh, Trump and that he would have elected or voted for Trump had he actually voted because he didn't vote. And also the reporter asked whether Kanye was going to perform at Trump's inauguration. And did y'all see how Kanye ass stood there like a damn lump on the log and would not answer the reporter? So see, now, since they are skirting past these questions that the reporters are asking, I think that something is going on. They discuss something that they don't want us to know. And deep in my heart, I kind of feel like Kanye probably will perform at Trump's inauguration. Did y'all see how he just stood up there with his hands folded? Didn't even answer the question. Oh, I just want to take a picture with Trump. <laughs> y'all, guarantee you, it would not surprise me if Kanye's ass perform at Trump's inauguration. Like it would not surprise me if he's up there on that stage acting like a fucking fool, okay? And looking like a fool too, all right? And so Kanye went to Twitter and he had some things to say about why he met with Donald Dump Trump. So check out these tweets. <laughs> Okay, so y'all saw the tweets that Kanye tweeted out. And y'all, I believe that he was in a 15 to 30 minute meeting, I believe. And do y'all actually believe that Kanye went to Trump and actually discussed multicultural issues? and issues like bullying, supporting teachers, modernizing curriculum, and violence in Chicago in just 15 to 30 minutes. I don't think that's what they discussed. You cannot discuss those issues in 15 to 30 minutes. It's just so much to talk about that you will not talk about all those issues. I don't care what they say. I do not care what they say. That is not what they were talking about. And besides, even if they did talk about that, 
do you really actually think that Trump gives a fuck? <laughs> I don't think Trump will give a damn about those issues in Chicago. <laughs> For real? That's why I believe that is not what they were talking about in that meeting. They were not talking about multicultural issues and shit like that in that meeting. I don't believe that for once. They were discussing other things in that meeting. And besides, who is Kanye kidding? He did not have to go to Trump to actually talk about these issues in his community. Kanye has a platform. Kanye could have been the one to go out and talk to his community about these issues. He could have been the spokesperson for these communities in Chicago. And he could have been addressing these issues to the community himself. He didn't have to go to Trump for that. And besides, did Kanye go to Obama and address these issues? Did he go to Obama and address these issues? I don't think so. So all this stuff is just leading me to believe that Kanye is doing this for attention, maybe. A publicity stunt, maybe. That's what I'm thinking. But this time, it, they was not talking about all that. I think they were talking about something else, and they just don't want us to know. And I do believe that I do believe that Kanye may appear at the Trump's inauguration. I believe that he may perform because he would not answer that reporter. He just stood up there with his arms crossed and would not reply to the reporter and i just think that when you don't answer questions then you're hiding things and that you don't want anyone to know and that's exactly what i think those two are doing they're hiding something from us you know people do put on fronts and lie for the public so the attention will be taken off of what they actually discuss behind the closed doors okay and that's just my opinion right and besides Kanye just got out of the hospital, what, like a couple of days ago? And you you going straight to talk to Donald Trump, Trump after you just got out of the fucking hospital, supposedly? That don't even sound right to me. Sit your ass down and recuperate and relax and just get your mind right before you going to talk to Donald Trump. Trump. And y'all, let me tell y'all something, okay? I, I got to get on his hair. Okay, because I think he done pulled a Britney Spears on our ass. Remember when Britney had that mental breakdown a couple of years ago and she cut off all her damn hair? <sighs> Kanye, the same thing it, with Kanye. Kanye had that mental breakdown. He go out and fucking dye his hair blonde. Like, for real, Kanye, you look silly with that blonde on top of your head like that. Just like Britney had that mental breakdown she cut off her hair Kanye had a mental breakdown he go dye his hair blonde go fucking figure go fucking figure <laughs> <sighs> okay y'all so I had to throw that in there I really did I did so what do y'all think about Kanye going to meet with Donald Donald Trump are you surprised about it because I'm really I'm really not surprised that he went to go meet with him and do y'all think that Kanye will perform at Trump's inauguration I am thinking that he probably will it wouldn't surprise it would not surprise me if I saw Kanye up on the stage performing I really think that a lot of the things that he's doing right now with Trump is probably for attention reasons. I'm always thinking that celebrities do stuff for attention, like <laughs> just to stay relevant and stay in the limelight and things like that. I always think that you got to make yourself look important. You got to keep people talking about you. So do things like this. Go talk to Donald Trump. Trump okay. So that's just my thinking, y'all. Y'all comment down below and let me know your thoughts. Y'all stay tuned for the next video.